James Hudson for Pro Boxing fans. Delighted to be joined with the Ultimate Boxer Heavyweights winner, Nick Webb. Nick, how do you feel? I feel amazing. I'm tired. <laughs> I want to party, but I want to sleep more. <laughs> Let's talk through the tournament yourself. First fight, Chris Healy. A lot closer than you thought it would be. How did, how did he kind of turn out compared to your last fight? Yeah, to be honest with you, I thought... In the actual fight, I thought I was winning every round. I wasn't getting it and I was doing the damage. So that they actually called it close. So I was like, whoa. I was very disappointed in my performance anyway, but I didn't think it was that close. Second fight, Danny Whitaker, the only knockout of the night. Yeah, Danny Whitaker, um, you know, he's a game kid. I knew he'd be game, but I just had the experience and I knew what to do with him. Was you surprised that Danny made it through to the second round to face you after Jonathan Pilata? I'll tell you what, he was a wild card. Fair play to Danny. He, he had a very good first fight and uh, fair play to him. He's only 2-0. and Absolutely. And then the final fight, Mark Bennett. It's just a war. I mean, talk us through the last fight. Yeah, I knew he can punch. I knew um, he's a tough man. So I knew I just had to use my boxing ability and jab his head off. And basically that's what I did. And now the tournament's done. What was your game plan going into this? How did you prepare? Uh, I prepared and just trained hard and, you know, I think I had a good run. I'd, I didn't take too much myself out of all the fights, so I'm fit and I was ready. Who was the toughest opponent tonight? I'd say Mark Bennett. Just kept coming forward, didn't he? Yeah, he's a tough man, tough man. How does that Golden Road feel? Feels exceptional. And then finally, from now on, where next? 2020, what is your aim? I have no clue. I'm going to enjoy Christmas hard. <laughs> Nick Webb, thank you very much for talking to Pro Boxing fans. I appreciate your time.